Hello again, welcome back to Diamond in the Rough Resale and my name is Dara, of course the owner of Diamond in the Rough Resale and we are continuing going through the boxes that I have gotten from my auction wins this week. About $200, a little more than $200 spent for all of the more fabulous boxes that I got and we've already gotten some fabulous things. If you go back to the videos that I've made before this one, you can see everything that I've gotten so far and I'm maybe halfway done. So stay with me and we will see what else we come up with. Okay, I'm gonna go open up this one. Oh boy. Okay, got some of this paper. Okay, I've got a little cobalt bottle. This is water or something or other. Natural mineral mineral water with carbonation, aqua madonna. I don't know, it's a pretty bottle. I'll take off the labels and sell it just, just like that. That'll be fun. Here's another Delft. This is a little planter. Of course, little Holland seams, very sweet. A good little planter. Okay, I'm gonna grab this. This is a little styrofoam container full of salt and peppers. Okay, I don't know how many of them are actually matched. Here is a Hallmark bunny. Here is a Art Mark little guy. Newer, see he's plastic on the bottom. We have a different bunny for salt. It says food safe and it's got another plastic stopper. Oh, huh. Tango. Hi, baby. What do you do? Come over here, Tango. Come over here. <laughs> this is really cute. It's salt and peeper. <laughs> That's precious. Tango. Oh, we got some little leftin. <laughs> leftin. There's some little pilgrims. You can't even see it. Tango. Come here, Tango. Oh my gosh, she's gonna wreck everything. Come here. Oh, she's my big man. Oh, she's my big man. You're my good boy. Wow, he likes it. No, he doesn't. Okay. Come here, buddy. Down we go. You've been fed. Go away. Okay. This is a sweet little egg. It's like an egg in an egg cup. Oh. Egg in an egg cup. I don't know. I don't think that matches. Mm -hmm. I don't think so. Um, mm -hmm. This one, Chicago. Mm -hmm. Chicago, and they do. They've got some chips, but you know, yeah, they're cute. Chips. Honey. <laughs> These are sweet. Oh, that one's all busted too. Dang it. Dang it. But they're gold. 22 karat gold. Got a little teeny tiny single thing. A little glass, whatnot. And I've got a single pepper. A little tin pepper. I've got Ireland. All Craft Ireland. Salt and peppers. Tango. <laughs> oh, okay. I just thought these were gonna be geese or something, but they don't have heads. <laughs> they look like geese bodies or something, but they don't have anything. They don't have heads or anything. Those are funny though. Made in China. Okay, here I have some random salts with different locations on them. Like this one says Chicago on it. It's wood. This one says, does it have an S on it too? Yeah, with an S. This one has an S on it, but no location. And then this one doesn't has a P and it says Lansing. That's weird. I don't know. Then we've got this random one that has a 
has a Bible verse on it. Oh, that's interesting. Yes, get your drink. And here are just some lids. A couple of random lids to whatever glass ones that there were. And here we've got some flute playing pigs from Japan. They're very funny. This one has some cracks and crazing. I don't know if they're full on cracks. I don't know. They're kind of fun, aren't they? I've got some lighthouses. Those are cute. No markings or anything. Just some cute little lighthouses. And we've got these little wood guys. Little carved wood ones. We got little feet. I'm assuming those unscrew or something. Or they cork out. Yeah, they cork out. Like that. There's like no space in there. It's weird. There's gotta be more decor than anything else. Hey Tango. What are you doing? Isn't he handsome? And these are cool. These are like little books. <laughs> Little salt and pepper books. Those are nice. I like salt and peppers. Mm -hmm. Such an easy thing to collect, you know? I like to put the salt on. on you put salt the in one and pepper in the other? And the, and the pepper in the other. Got some bits and pieces and mm -hmm. random ones and Tana, can you get off the counter please? I'm gonna be getting the other glasses the glass out. So. Please get down. Okay. Thank you. Alright. Salt and pepper. Ooh, that coffee sounds really good. Okay. What else do we have here? We have more Delft. See. More Delft. You like it? Tango. Do you approve? No? <laughs> uh, this is cute. Made in China. Nice paintings. Oh, you see the dragonfly and the flowers? Did you see me? It's a nice face. Of course we see you. Me, I hiccuped. Okay, bye bye. This is a nice one, too. Look at that. It's heavy. <clears throat> wow, I've got hiccups. We had lunch and now I have hiccups. This is cute. What does it say? Oh, it's Nippon. That's fabulous. And here is an old faithful Yellowstone, big old glass. they watch them. <laughs> Lead boil. Rope. Bombs. Yeah, I love bombs. That's what. Okay, this red one is Universal Cambridge. Oven proof. And it does have a little chip right there and it's got crazy. It's this little oven bowl. Red. This is green. It's not marked anywhere. It's this little green bowl. Here we've got this lovely, this looks like um, Ken Edwards. Of course, it's not the bird, so it's probably not, and it's not signed that I can see, but like Mexican pottery, tonala. Very pretty. Hey, look it. We got some mushrooms. Some little mushrooms on a piece of wood on wire. Those are cool. No signature or anything, but there's some little mushrooms. We love mushrooms. This is pretty. Not marked. Should have sticker residue. This little pot. Probably had a lid at one point. A couple more. We have a, oh, this is neat. Great gatherings. Microwave and dishwasher safe made in China. That's really cool. 
Those would be some nice dishes to have. Here's just a bowl out of some collection. Here's a wooden bowl. This little turned wooden bowl. It's neat looking. I like it. And then this little planter deal. It has a plug in the bottom. It is not marked. It has like painted tulips and whatnot on it. It's a nice little planter. And I got another box here that we can go through. Excuse me, sorry, I got a runny nose now. All right. This is a little candle holder. It says face. You can put two little tea lights in there. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. It's got some chips in it. Family Dollar Services. Family Dollar. Here is a little box. It's a baby box. It says B is for babies and bottles, bunnies and bears, booties and belly buttons, bibs and blessings. That's very sweet. And on the back it has a little poem. And it's just a little baby box. That's really sweet. Remember, keep the volume down. This is lovely. Look at this pottery vase. I love the glaze. Honeymoon Smiles. Smiles? 1956? I like it. It's a very, very cool little vase. We have some brass. Lord knows I need new grass. Ooh, this is Baldwin. Very nice. Okay. I love this. She does have a broken finger. Let's see. I'm not sure if she had earrings or not, but she's a little planter. Like little face head planter girl. This is a Relpo. Relpo head planter. This is from Miss Evans to Ruth, Easter, 1936. It's kind of cool. We're going to have to have like a religious area. This is neat. I'm not going to take that out. It's like a shell sculpture. It's very delicate and dainty. I'm gonna go to Swan stained glass. <laughs> it's pretty cute. The beak looks like it needs a little we work. We need to add a goat. He's gotta be careful. Like a goat? Yeah. Don't they have goats? I don't think so. Behold, I stand at the door and knock. Behold, I stand at the door. Behold. <laughs> Another little religious dude. Michigan Rocks, State Treasures. This is just a little, just a magazine or whatnot on a thing with another thing, but it doesn't have the frame, the frame for it, that's weird. Oh well, here's a little metal sign. Let's see, it says, be a light in this world for your neighbor to see and spread forth your love in remembrance of me. That's kind of cool. Bookshelf Memorials by Trademark Designs. I wonder if I flip if we have. Oh, Serenity Prayer. Likes on our videos. Serenity Prayer plaque. And it's inscripted Dear Corey, I received this as a gift some time ago. Now I give it to you. We can change anything we want as long as God is in our hearts. 
Wisdom is in our and wisdom is in our heads. Take care of yourself. Your friend Charlie. That's nice. I'm gonna do this at the uh, I'm gonna do this at the end of the uh, Oh uh, the, at the end of this video. Here is the frame. I'm assuming this is the frame for that Michigan Rocks thing. Let's see if it works. Hmm. It does. It fits. I found some food on this game. Pretty amazing. All right. Some yeah. food? Yeah. Well, this is cool. Luster Pitcher, it says. Okay. okay, so it's a little pottery pitcher with bamboo. Wait. That's cool. Very pretty. No, this. I'm making a mess in here. I got so much stuff. Oh man. Those are mine. I know. Oh no, please don't tell me. Bookends. These are also, I want to know more so I can be more honest, more courageous, funny, and loving. I want to know more so I can become a better human being. Maya Angelou. Little wooden bookends. Those are nice. This is like a copper plate. Copper plate. It's like embossed and whatnot. It almost looks like an egg tray, doesn't it? Kind of does. That's crazy. I don't see any signatures, but that's really cool. Copper plate. Okay, I'm moving this down because it's huge. Mine share. We've got a lot of nice clear glass in this little box here. So let's see what we have. I have this clear, it's like a ring holder, but it has big edges, crystal of some I kind. Made a, I made a torch. I made a torch. I have, it looks like a sugar bowl. Oh yeah, and here's the creamer to no match. No access. And cream and sugar. And no access. Here's just a little dish. Dishes are nice. I'm trying to figure out what to bring out first here. This is cool. I like the shape of this. It's in good shape. Here is another this is an ashtray. You can see the little edges, the indents on the edges. Lovely little ashtray. <clears throat> Here's a little vase. A little crystal vase is pretty. This is heavy. Very heavy little sugar bowl. You can see it's etched. And we have the matching creamer. It's always good to have a match. Those are pretty. Heavy. Here's another little dish. A little bowl. I have no match. Whoops. Ah! Sorry. This is pretty. Very pretty. I like it. Okay, we got some green Box things no here. Oh, yeah. yeah. We'll call it a cream and sugar. They match. Egg. Little. Egg. So small. Egg. 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 This is another heavy one. A little vase. Got the top of a trinket box. 
heart shaped, but I don't have the base of it in this box. Maybe elsewhere. I hope elsewhere. This is a Mikasa Japan. Looks like a bud vase. Yes, dear. Anne's Hallmark of Norton Shores. This is a Lefton. It's a 40th anniversary vase. You see 25th and 50th a lot, but not a lot of 40th. Interesting. I'm only 40 years old. I can't imagine being married for that long. Well, I suppose I can. This is interesting, isn't it? It's a little art glass vase. And it's... You see how it's kind of bent like that? It's kind of neat. But it's got like a yellow, yellow at the top and then clear at the bottom. No markings. It's kind of cool. Here's a hat. This reminds me a lot of a, um, oh my goodness. Not left Fenton. It reminds me of Fenton glass, but of course it's not marked, so I don't think it's really Fenton. With this cute little glass hat. Very cute. Pretty ceramic vase. It's got the remnants of a barcode on the bottom. It's pretty cool though. Look at the markings on it. The glaze is beautiful. It's like a drift glaze. I like it. Here is a purple glass vase with gold. It's got like a remnants of a garage sale sticker. But that's pretty. Purple. Here's a lovely floral vase. It's got a scalloped rim up here. It's got a Goodwill sticker on the bottom. Let's take the Goodwill sticker off. Carefully. Made in China. That's pretty though. What's this? What is this? If I can complete the scheme. What would they have put in this? What would this have been used for? If you know, comment, would you? Got like a silver top. It's like a little clamshell looking guy. Let's see if it's marked. I mean, it's silver for sure. It looks like silver. I don't see any markings on it. I don't want to try to open it. It's stuck. Knowing my luck, I'd break it. Here's another little painted vase. It's like a little artist piece. So it's really pretty. Butterflies and flowers. <laughs> Again, thanks, Spring. This is a lovely little jar. Not marked, really like muted tones, pretty floral. And then this beauty, this lovely vase, and it is marked Japan on the bottom. That's pretty. Got one more little thing in here is a sun catcher. It's a sandal sun catcher. Something about best friends. Best friends forever. That's kitschy. Oh, oh that's fun. Okay, I'm going to pause it, get another box, and we will keep on going. Okay. Okay, so this one, I had got a, an office lot because there were a couple things in it that weren't necessarily office but I wanted them. So we're gonna go through, part of the office lot is in here. Some of it's gonna be strange, I don't know. Okay, we've got a little sewing kit. Looks like it came from the Gin, Gin Hammock Beach Resort. Little sewing kit, those are always nice. I've got a little sharp calculator. I've got a multilingual translator. That should be interesting. I've got, 
quilting, quotations celebrating an American legacy, and it's got a thimble. We make a quilt to help us always remember home. That's kind of cute. I've got a mini playing cards from Royal Gorge, California, Colorado. I can read, I swear, I swear to God I can read. These are cute. Look at these, <laughs> they're so cute. Nope, they're all here. Many playing cards. That is so cute. That's adorable. Oh my gosh. I like that a lot. Okay, here's a little notebook. It's got a little elephant on it and some woven decorations and just some little little white pages. Sparty! It's a team ornament. Sparty. My dad went to Michigan State. Club Blue. Looks like an eyeglass case. Yeah, it's a little eyeglass case. Interesting. This is cool. St. Petersburg Beach, Florida. It's a thermometer and it has shells inside. That's neat. A little touristy thing. It says 60-ish degrees in here. I don't know how accurate that is since it's in the water and the water was cold. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> Just a little Knoll Worldwide Ruler. Compliments of the Rustin Coca-Cola Bottling Company in Rustin, Louisiana. So like a weather brush or a smacker. Ooh, that would hurt. I don't like that at all. Drink Coca-Cola in bottles. Every bottle sterilized and washed eight times. We bottle the highest and best grade soda waters that can be manufactured. That's that's really crazy. And some Coke nostalgia collector stuff. I'll look up the see if it's worth anything before I give it to my son for his collection. Doral special edition playing cards. Oh, and they're packaged still. Welcome to the place that Doral calls home, Tobaccoville, North Carolina. Ooh. All right. Tobacco memorabilia. Here is a Honeywell yeah this is the old one that somebody replaced with this one but hey a thermostat Honeywell thermostat make sure it works and I can totally sell that. Hey Cooper! Oh Cooper I'm gonna have all the kitties bugging me today. Down you go. Eric, another fan. I just bought Eric a fan yesterday at the thrift store. That's pretty. It's like never been opened, it's very tight. Hey, look, a shoehorn. Another little ruler. <gasps> CDs. I got a CD case. The Word Becomes Flesh. Complete New Testament read by women. 3 of 18. Are they all here? Interesting. Hmm. It's this whole Bible thing. Read by women. Okay, this is one of the reasons I bought it. It was a little brass mouse ring holder. Stop it. And I had one in my booth that sold and I'm kind of sad it sold because I really liked it. So cute. I like it. Okay, I gotta get rid of this cat. No mice for you. No mice for you. Go away, Cooper. Okay. He's so cute, but oh my gosh, is he annoying. Okay. Careful. This. Ooh, 
Ooh, it's RS Prussia. Look at this. It is a trinket box. It's got a little flower. Are you okay? Did you inhale your spit? Poor baby. So this is a little trinket dish. See? It's got different little things. It does have a chip here on the inner rim. But that's really cool. I love RS Prussia. Okay, I've got this interesting kind of broken angel. Christmas angel, Italian handcrafted painted antique ornament. I'm gonna say something's busted off, but it's just her hand, which is right here. So I could technically fix that. I don't know. We'll see. She's kind of cool. Interesting. I've got another one. This one's a little more busted. And someone tried to use like expanding glue to fix it. Yeah, there's another one. Those are neat. Fix them up a little bit. Here is a little battery operated. Probably has a light in it. So this is a little battery operated angel thing. Sure. <laughs> we got some shot glasses. I've got one from Puerto Rico, one from Peru. I like Peru. I've never been there, but one of my, my great uncle, he worked there for a good long time. What did he work for? Did he work for GM? I don't remember which car company he worked for. That's terrible, I should remember that. Spode, fine bone China, England. It's this little dish, it's a little saucer. Spode. This is another, this one's marked H with laurel leaves. So saucer. I've got this beautiful little dish. It's a little lidded glass dish. We got some more. This one's California. This one, golightly.com. Is United States Air President of the United States Air Force One. This is pretty. France. This is a made in France one. It says something. M Missery. Hmm. I like when they're signed, then I can look them up. And these ones are very cute. This remind me mid century modern. Red, green, white, with little fishies. Those are cute. All right, that was all for this box. Then we'll do this box and call it a day for this video. Pretty. This is just like a mishmash of things. I love it. Okay, we've got a little painted dish. little teeny tiny egg cup. You can probably put like a quail egg in that. That's pretty. What's this? <laughs> I don't know. Whoever was trying to sell her had her priced at 12 bucks. I don't know. She's this very large bag lady thing. She's very cute. This is this teeny tiny little pitcher. It's Southwest or Mexican. This is a Blue Sky Clay Works. Warning, never leave a burning candle. Okay, so this would be a tea light holder. I love pretty random things. Ooh. Valentine.
Valentine's Day is next week. Next week? This weekend? Sometime, I don't know. Valentine's Day. There's little hearts in there. Okay, and here I have three of these. They are missing some jewels. You see they're blue with gold, and then these little red gem thingies glued onto them. And I've got three of them. And they are all missing at least one gem. Yep, at least one gem. But yeah, I got three of them. They're kind of cool looking. Here's another anniversary. It's the 25th anniversary vase with the silver. The silver overlay. Here's a little dish, a little Catalina souvenir dish. I got a boot. It's a little boot. Made in Japan. Little painted boot. It's very sweet. A little basket, <laughs> ivory looking basket, made in China, sticker on the bottom. So that's pretty. Happy. It just says happy. I think it's probably an anniversary thing. It's happy. That's kind of cute. Distributed by Century. Dishwasher safe. Hmm. This is a pretty little dish. Here's a little teacup. Loma Productions. It's a cute little teacup. Really lightweight, but thick. It's weird. What? <laughs> a boot! This reminds me of Fenton. It is chipped big old chunk taken out right here. That's too bad, but it's pretty. I'll just close the flaw and put it in my booth. This still look good on the shelf on the other side. See, you can't tell from this side that it's chipped. <laughs> WCL made in China. It's a nice little bowl. Ooh, it's a perfume bottle. Ooh, baby. Look at that. The dipper is still in there. That's fantastic. Ooh, I got another one. This one's intact too. Sweet. Look how pretty. Made in Egypt, this one says. That's very cool. I like perfume bottles. Ooh. Those are delicate. I'm surprised they're in good shape. It's a little vase. A little crystal glass vase. This one says Italy. Yarmouth, Yarmouth Pewter. Made in Italy. This little dish. This little box. It's got a dent. <laughs> okay, what's this? This is cute. Steinbach. Handmade in Austria. Cute little dish. Look at that. I love it. Here we have a pretty little sugar bowl. Bavaria. With a little lid. It's very cute and sweet. And we have a little matching teapot with no lid. But isn't that cute? No, it's not really interchangeable. But that's pretty. <laughs> All right, that does it for these boxes, guys. I'm so happy that you joined me. I hope you made it to the end of this one. I know we had some very interesting and random things in here. Nice stuff, though. I'm excited. I really like these perfume bottles. So I hope you join me again next time when we go through some more of these boxes and unbox all of this fabulous auction winning stuff. Make sure to subscribe, subscribe and like. Oh yes, please like and subscribe. <laughs> because also Eric said so. <laughs> yeah, because hit that bell notification to be notified. <laughs> Bye.